you can tell I'm so bad at turning this one because like most of these are like pretty even in their growth <laughs> but this one we got like the leaves are like double long to those leaves and it's because I don't turn it enough or when I turn it I turn it 360 degrees on accident and then I'm like it's turned damn homie if I would have known your roots were that long I would not have kept you in that little thing for that long I'm sorry I was just trying to wait till it got warm no, because some of these are seriously so long that the roots are taller than the pot. Like, <laughs> she's so tired from being out in the sun. She is me. I am her. Who's hot to you other than Harry Styles? People who look like Harry Styles. <laughs> I know everyone always talks about how they feel bad for Gen Alpha and Gen Z like growing up with internet but I just want to do my own little talk about how I feel bad about it because um yesterday a like eight-year-old called me cringe for eating a strawberry like the way I was eating it I guess was cringe or something I don't care but it made me sad and I wanted to like shake her and be like wake up from the cringe culture you will never have fun you're supposed to be being a child i but i did tell her i was like if you spend your life worrying about what is cringe you will never have fun i may be cringe but i'm free you know type beat but and it just makes me sad, too, because, like, even kids can't even post online without people, like, critiquing them, like, especially, like, libs. It's so fucking dumb. Like, I see so many girls post, like, a trend that they saw some other TikToker or YouTuber doing. And then the comments are, like, on, like, an eight-year-old's post. Don't ask why I'm looking at the comments on the eight-year-old's post. It's because I thrive off of negativity like this. And I like to see that there's people worse out there than me, maybe. I don't know why. Let's, that's... We'll unpack that a different day. But the point is, I see these people, and they're like, it's giving pick me. It's giving I'm not like the other girls. She's eight. That's when you go through the I'm not like the other girls phase. That's when you, like, find your shit. That's when you have those moments. That's when you are cringe. I just, w I just hope kids these days get more opportunities to be cringe and get more lenience because it's so hard out there that you can't be eight or else you get called cringe or a pick me or some other thing is like they're eight they're nothing they're nothing other than an eight-year-old they're not a pick me they're not cringe they're eight years old